making our way back out to Megason Road. Right across the way are some of the patio villa homes. And we're gonna hang a right right here on Megason. And then make our way, oh, check it out. There you go, not only got the United States flag, but it's five o'clock somewhere flag flying. But they're fun neighbors to have. Yep. To next, Tiffany. We are going to drive through the newest section, which is called Dabney. I think they still call it Lake Denham for a little bit. We'll look when we pull off the road, but then to Dabney, which is one of the newest that has homes available to buy right now. Yep, and then after that, we're going to go over to the brand new section. They just started selling home sites, and that one's called Moultrie Creek. Moultrie Creek. And there you go, deja vu, Harper Villas again. <laughs> If we move to the newer sections, this would be our closest rec center. This is Franklin Recreation. It's a neighborhood rec center. It has a family pool here. And then it also has bocce, shuffleboard, pickleball, corn toss, I think is what they call it. Let's go poke our head inside real quickly and just see what this one's themed like. And from what I've heard, or from what Tiffany already told us, I think it's decorated like a watermelon. at the pool so I can film the pool maybe. Can you get up that way? So since it's a cloudy overcast day, no one is at the pool which makes it a great opportunity to come film it and show you the pool without having without having to worry about filming anybody. So here's a family pool. Like the little palm trees over here, that's great. Yeah, and it's going to get very windy later tonight. And overnight tonight, and Monday and Tuesday, both days, lots of wind. Uh, breezy during the day with gusts in the 20s, okay? Right now, 72 degrees, though, and a nice evening to get out and enjoy the day. It's quick. Where is the bank? It's the last one. Where is the bank? It's the last one. 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 It's the last
it didn't look like much from the road i'll be honest but once you get back here i love all the video games in there i think we would definitely hang out there <laughs> um, you got the outside exercise equipment here the pool is beautiful it overlooks the pitch and putt and the putting green um, so yeah it's really there's a lot more here than it really looked like from before there is the entrance and exit to Lake Denham and now we're gonna take a left in here into Dabney and the wild thing is just a couple of months ago when we were first starting this process to come out here and look at homes none of this was built just a couple of months ago this was all dirt there wasn't a single wall or a house or anything so it is amazing how fast they could build these and these courtyard villas behind this wall to the right, those are available now. And then we'll drive through and show you a section of homes that are kind of unique. So these are patio villas called Anison Villas. So this is very similar to the type of homes that we stayed in for our lifestyle visit. So if you wanna see what a patio villa looks like, go back and check out some of our lifestyle visit videos and some of these are available to buy now I don't think all of them are available but some are available to buy right now so one of the things that we figured out about the patio villas is some of these really cute ones here that have the little white picket fences are very very cute but if they had the white picket fence means there's no golf cart garage but it does look like it has a two-car garage and then right next door to it you see that little uh, front area off of the lanai that is the golf cart garage so if it has the white picket fence no golf cart garage no white picket fence means it has a golf cart garage hopefully that makes sense it looks like someone just bought and moved in <laughs> All right, where do you mean to drive to next, sweetheart? Next over is the cottage and ranch home. Yeah, they're the ones right there. All right. You can see. <laughs> so right off of Megason, which is one of the main roads in Dabney here, they have what's called Chandler Drive. It seems like that's the main road for all the homes back here in Dabney. you can see the back of these and we'll pull in in just a moment but these are um, a series of homes called cottage and ranch homes and we really haven't found many of those when we've been looking I think we saw one little section up there in Newell um, and then some in the older sections but these are stick built frame vinyl and then they usually have a small an eye on the back And we'll have to check and see if you see any golf cart garages here, honey. All right, I'm looking. There's the little small and eye on the back, like you said. So, yeah, the big difference between these and the patio villas is uh, the patio villas has the front lanai. These have the little small back lanai. And I do not see any golf cart garages. It looks like these are all just two-car garages, no golf cart. And I think... The square footage on these run from about 11 to 1500 square feet. And they are on the lower side of the price range, right? I think like upper twos to low threes. I have to check that out. 
I wonder if they just bought the house. Yeah. Or they're thinking about it. Yeah, they yeah. got their realtor with them. <laughs> Oh yeah, they did. Yeah, they were taking a picture of one. <laughs> That's great. So yeah, right on the other side of that fence right there, you can see those are patio villas that we were just in that neighborhood. And then you have these right here. Yep. Because it is an adult pool back here, right? Yes. And we'll make our way past all these designer homes and then we're gonna go just check out the outside uh, they they have a recreation center down here they do and I think it's supposed to be an adult pool okay not a family pool so, so. we're gonna go check that out so if we do move in this area this would be the closest adult pool to us how different this looks with houses built you know because yeah here's more patio villas right here i think too right yes yeah so it looks like they're building a brand new patio villa village right across the way there and as we take a left onto chandler drive we are going to immediately turn into the Dabney Recreation Center. So straight ahead is the postal facility. Looks like we've got some pickleball courts back there. Or are they tennis courts? So one of the awesome things for these new homes being built right across the street is, well, they just got across the street either on foot or by golf cart. And you'll be right here at the Dabney Recreation and Postal Facility there. There's all the info that you might need. And then right over here to our right is the pool. And we're pretty sure this is an adult only pool, not a family pool. I don't think it's open quite yet, but we'll walk up here and give it a quick glance. Let's see if it's unlocked or not. Nope, it's all locked up so you can't get in. But you can see what this pool area is going to look like. Look like there's a little nature area, maybe a walking path back there in the back side of the pool. Then off in the distance back there, you can see they're getting ready to build new homes. little walking area called the Dabney Pathway.
So as you can see, some of these homes back right up to the rec center. Some people may love that. Some people may not love that. Uh, if you're very social, then that's going to be awesome because you can sit on your back lanai and wave and talk to everybody and then walk over here and use all the amenities. But if you're someone who wants a little bit more privacy, then uh, that's probably not going to be the right home site for you. But that's the great thing about the villages. They have so many different home sites and homes to choose from. Information board here, no info yet. And then it looks like we have tennis courts to the left. There are the tennis courts. And then over here to our right are the pickleball courts. And they're all locked up for right now, so we can't use them. But hopefully those will be opening up really, really soon. So we're saying goodbye to Dabney for now. And as we exit out of here, we're gonna take a left back onto Megasin Road. And this is as far south as Megasin Road goes, because now we're gonna exit out of the Lake Denham entrance and exit. Brand new guardhouse there. And if you take a left, that will take you into Leesburg. We're going to take a right on the County Road 470 here. And there is the sign for the village of Lake. And there's the sign for the village of Lake Denham. So let's take a right here on County Road. And then straight ahead up in the distance is one of the entrances and the exits to the Florida Turnpike, which is something that. Uh, appeals to us. We want to be close to the Florida Turnpike so we can get on and off easily. We just don't want to live right next to the Florida Turnpike. Right. Because we do have to travel, we do have to get to the airport, we do like to go to Disney World and stuff like that, so this will make it very, very convenient, very, very easy to get to and from all the other places we need to go, but we don't want to be right next to it or right next to all these power lines. over the Florida Turnpike we are now on the other side and all of this empty land that you see in front of us is gonna eventually be the villages right it's been a long day but it's been an awesome day and we're back in the parking lot where we started this video we're back at Sawgrass Grove and I think we're gonna go inside and get some food here in just a minute right yes it is definitely food time <laughs> We thought this would only take us about an hour, an hour and a half, but we've been driving around looking at all the different uh, villages themselves and the different homes, and there's a lot to choose from, and we're getting really, really close to making a decision, right? We are very close, and I think today <laughs> helped us solidify some of those decisions. So uh, the only thing left to do is to go find us some food, check out what's happening at Sawgrass Grove, and then we'll see you in the next video where we hope to have some very exciting news to share with you.
Pizza's right to your right. What you want to get? I had the carne last time. Yeah. You get that and get something else. I don't I'll care. Get that. It was good. Tried something different? Hello. Let's do one carne to go, please. 